Plenty by Kevin Connolly. The sky, lit up like a question or an applause meter, is beautiful like everything else today. The leaves in the gutters, salt stains on shoes, the girl at the IGA who looks just like Julie Delpy, but you don't tell her. She's too young to get the reference, and coming from you, it'll just seem creepy. <laughs> so much beauty today, you can't find room for it. Closets already filled with beautiful trees, and smells, and glances, and clever turns of phrase. Behind the sky, there's a storm on the way, which, with your luck, will be a beautiful storm. Dark clouds, beautiful as they arguably are. The rain, beautiful as it always is. Even lightning can be beautiful in a scary kind of way. There's a word for that, but let's forget it for the moment. And maybe the sun will hang in long enough to light up a few raindrops, like jewels or glass, or those bright beads girls put between the letters on the bracelets that spell out their beautiful names, Sky or Miranda or Veranda, which isn't even a name, although it is a word we use to call things what they are, and would be a pleasant place to sit and watch the beautiful sky, beautiful storm, the people with their beautiful names walking toward the lake in lovely clothing, saying unpleasant things over the phone about the people they work with. <laughs> All of it just adding to the mother load. The surfeit of beauty, which on this day is just a fancy way of saying lots, too much, Skid loads, plenty.